Your opening contest is scheduled for one fall. Well, Tyler Foster, I don't, that wasn't much of an apology. Not, not in the traditional sense, no. And right now, you're looking at a very unhappy menage a trois as the gold is not around any of their weights any longer. Not yet. Not yet, but CJ Ward has the opportunity to be an MPX champion here tonight. But right now, Tatum Manning's redemption tour begins as he makes his way back where he belongs. And that would be with the MPX Addicts Championship around his waist. And of course, he lost that title last week to our new champion, Chandler Hopkins. And of course, with MPX, there are no automatic rematches. So it's back to the bottom you go, Tatum Manning. I have faith in Tatum Manning. He's going to work his way back into contention. And that starts right here, right now. Introducing first, from South Lake, Texas, he is a member of Menage a Trois, one in a million, Tatum Manning! Still sporting that cowboy jacket, I see. He is. I, I think he's taking, a, he's taking a liking to the cowboy jacket. It, it's very nice. And of course, our, our crowd here in Bedford, Texas, not the biggest fans of South Lake, Texas, apparently. I don't know what they don't like about South Lake. South Lake's a wonderful town. You been, been to the town square? They, they, they have the roundabouts, and they're a little uppity. They got an outside mall. It's a nice I mean, place. Nice it's, place to go. It's an expensive place. Let's put it that way. It is. That's, that's true. Well, here comes someone who's not into expenses that pays. Big Fitz does what it takes to get the job done no matter what. He is an Army veteran, and he had a hell of a rookie campaign here at MPX. And Big Fitz, oh yeah, Tatum Manning has bailed out. Big Fitz looking to pick up a victory here tonight. And his opponent from Fort Benning, Georgia, Big Fitz! Big Fitz in tag team action last week, stepping back into the singles ranks here tonight to take on Tatum Manning. Guys, I can't help but notice, but is there something different about Tatum Manning this week? It seems like he's missing something. I can't quite put my thing. Oh, it's the Addicts Championship. That's right. And as we brought up, Cody, there are no automatic rematches, so it's back to the bottom that Tatum goes. Of course, we're going to see the new Addicts Champion in action later on tonight. Young Gun Chandler Hopkins taking on Jackson Stone. You know, Chandler Hopkins, the last time he held that Addicts title, he didn't hold on to it very long, so we'll see if he uh, can survive Jackson Stone here later tonight. Well, and Tatum Manning looking to bounce back here this week with a win, but he's got a huge obstacle in front of him, and that obstacle's name is Big Fitz. Uh, li literally a huge obstacle. Big Fitz, a giant of a man, and Tatum Manning, well, I was gonna say showing no fear, but did you say obstacle or popsicle? Obstacle. Oh. Well, you couldn't have two more complete opposite of people here on the ring. You've got a guy, Big Fitz, who served his country, former Army drill sergeant, stepped up, did what he had to do. And you've got a guy like Tatum Manning, who probably ran the other direction, did everything he could to hide behind daddy's money in his lavish home in, in South Lake. I don't think uh, Big Fitz looks too kindly on someone like Tatum Manning. Manning sitting in the ropes. Huge shoulder tackle from Fitz. He whipped him in by his head. All right, if I were Big Fitz, I would be envious of a guy like Tatum Manning. Tatum Manning, a two-time MPX Tag Team Champion, former MPX Attic Champion. Uh, what's uh, How much gold has Big Fitz held? Big Fitz still, of course, very early in his MPX career. Both these guys were, were candidates for the 2019 Rookie of the Year. I think it could have went either way. Big Fitz had a great 2019. What? Big Fitz didn't have a good 2019. What do you mean it could go either way? It could have went either way. He just told you two-time MPX Tag Team Champion and Addicts Champion at the time of the voting. Well, maybe if... How uh, is it going to go either well, way? let me tell you. Let me tell you. Maybe if Big Fitz had, Big, had Big ran Fitz with a crew Hulk of... Hogan. Maybe if Big Fitz ran with a, a crew of guys that helped him win all his matches... He did. They were called the Army. They're not out here ringside for his matches. Oh, he needs to get better friends. Well, he did bring a, he brought a grenade in the ring last week, so maybe he should have been a Marine. How was the uh, VIP room last week, guys? We're, we're not going to talk about it. As Manning takes out that. We're getting ready for the celebration that's going to happen tonight. 
when Tatum Manning wins, when C.J. Ward captures the MPX championship, it'll be a huge night in the VIP room. Manning looking to put away Fitz with that kick. And look, only a one count. And look at the power of Big Fitz. I, I was actually not allowed to go into the VIP room last, last week. Uh, I worked the door, though. So I got to talk to Did everybody. Did you get some good when, tips? When they came out, they told me all about it. Oh, okay. well, but they said this week for sure I'm in. CJ's celebration, I mean, it's going to be great. Well, we had a nice celebration over at uh, Billy Bob's last week with the new Addicts champion. No one Should have been there. We had mechanical bulls. No, no one has ever had a good time at Billy We Bob's. had a nice George Strait oh. cover band. It was great. Oh. Huge top from Fitz. Oh. And another one right across the chest of the kid from South Lake. Tatum needs to work harder. Or this is going to be another slow night in the VIP room. Yo, Tatum Manning getting the boot up. Stopping Big Fitz in his tracks. Yeah. Drop kick from that middle turnbuckle. Manning with the cover. Only a two count. You don't see Big Fitz doing a lot of middle row drop kicks. But that's your rookie of the year, I guess. Well, and Manning raining down those right hands. We talked about later on that four-way main event for the title. Of course, Hopkins versus Stone. And how about Gino Medina taking on Barrett Brown? What a match that's going to be. Sky Della Cremosa is here tonight, one week after defeating the innovator of violence, Tommy Dreamer. De La Camosa on a huge roll after that, that win last week. Well, we Tatum Manning, he's taking control of the big man here. No big fits. Hold it onto that top rope. And it's sending Manning against those ropes. There's another huge chop. Irish Whipsons, Tatum in. Oh, up and over. Goes after that left knee again. You know, Big Fitz was trying to send him through the roof there. And Manning trying to chop the big man down for size. Only a two count this time. What's it going to take for Tatum Manning to keep Big Fitz down, though? Man of Big Fitz size, it's not easy getting him down. You know, once you get him down, you got to do everything you can to keep him down. He regains that vertical base, and oh. Big Fitz is dangerous. Well, we saw this last week. This is with this huge oh. Sudwander suplex. No, oh. Manning Manny reversed Manning held it. out. He held on the whole time. Goes for a cover. Only a two count. I think Fitz might have taken a little bit too much time to get that Sudwander suplex. And now Manning full Nelson. Yeah, I don't think full Nelson is the way you want to go here. Uh, I think too much, too much size in the favor of Big Fitz there. Now Tatum Manning looking for this sleeper. That's one way to bring down a giant. You put him to sleep. Cut off that oxygen. Big Fitz having none of it, though. And just yanks Tatum Manning over with ease. Remember, the last time we saw Tatum Manning versus Big Fitz in a singles match was about eight months ago, and it ended with an F-bomb through the ring. Could we see history repeating itself right now? Or with the experience that Tatum's gathered throughout these months come into play? Oh, and look at that cross body. That's one of the biggest crossbodies you're going to see anywhere. And Big Fitz got every bit of that Tatum Manning. Well, he might be he's priming Manning up for that F-bomb. I think that might be what he's looking for. Uh-oh. Is he going to nail it? Well, Manning's got to come up with something quick. Or this is going to be it. Manning might have a losing streak on his hands after this. Oh. Big Fitz tumbled. And Manning now, he's got to stay on the big man. Not sure what he's what he's got planned here. Potato Manning pulling him up. Oh! oh! Scissor kick across the back of the head. Can Manning capitalize? Big Fitz is hurt. I think one of those punches he gave him in the, in the power bomb position may have caught Fitz right in the eye. There's Tato Manning up top. Oh! Oh! Manning with that South Lake Swanton, a cover, and that's gonna do it. Your winner of the match, one in a million, Tato Manning. Tato Manning has the experience advantage, even though they're both young in their career. It's with strength, but it was all experience. Tatum countered everything that Big Fitz tried, Tyler. Like you said, eight months ago, Big Fitz got the win over Tatum Manning. It's a much different story with a very much 
different Tatum Manning. And the Redemption Tour begins tonight. Tatum Manning picking up a huge victory to work his way back into title contention where he belongs. Guys, are we going to see another member of Menage a Trois victorious later on tonight? Can CJ Ward bring the MPX Championship back to Menage a Trois? We're going to find out in the main event here at MPX's Leap of Faith.